Hey Capricorns, this is your girl Healing Truth. When I was meditating on your energy, um, uh, I had uh, a, a feeling or the energy of someone around you is intimidated that you get messages from the Most High. And they could possibly get messages too, but they don't tap into themselves like you have. So people are jealous of your gifts. Um, I heard the song by Little Kim. Can you hear me now? Um, so I'm getting. I'm. I was also getting that um, someone didn't hear you before, and what you said they wasn't listening. And and uh you proven something like um just going with the flow and you like uh can you hear me now i mean you didn't hear me before but can you hear me now so uh i'm getting a sense that they hear you now they uh they can't ignore the fact or they can't ignore what you have said i'm getting that this is someone really close to you and um like um they try to like ignore what you said or or um she don't know what she's talking about he don't know what he talking about type energy um i also got that song with fantasia um summertime Your daddy's rich and your mommy's good looking. So I don't know who that's significant for, but what I got from that um, song is co-parenting. I don't know. <laughs> I got co-parenting from that, from that song. Like the father pays for everything and the mom just sits there and looking good. I'm also getting that you're getting a gut feeling about something or you or you have a gut feeling about something. You might need to just follow through with that. We're going to go with the healing truth cards first. Oh, I also got um I also got like your words are powerful. Whatever you say, kind of like what we were talking about before, where they, the person, like he don't know what, what he talking about, she don't know what she talking about. Your per, your words are very powerful. I also was, I was about to say pearls. I don't know if you're getting pearls or if you have some pearls, maybe from a a grandmother or something like that. Um, you need to wear them more. Your pearls. Um. But yes, your words are very powerful and you know this and I think you refrain from saying a lot of things because you know how powerful your words are. I'm getting that really strongly. Um, I'm also getting you might have gas, farting a lot, somebody around you farting a lot. But anywho, we're going to move on. The Healing Truth deck, this is for the Capricorns. Healing Truth Deck. This is for the Capricorns. Healing Truth Deck. This is for... Oh, that's a lot. Healing Truth Deck. This is for the Cap. Um, the, the color green um, might be significant for you too. Like, maybe you need to get out in nature more a little bit to tap in. Or harness or um, control or... Uh, better control your gifts if you feel like um, if you feel like it isn't um, uh, like like this is new so you want to get out in nature more which you are a Capricorn you rule you rule you rule the earth rule So, um, you want to better know, that's just like if you 
started a new job or something of that nature and um you you know what this McDonald's did but this is a new McDonald's so they might run it a different way so you want to um learn or relearn something to better your position if you get what I mean if that made any sense You want to always make sure you're on top of things. I'm also getting that you need to soak your feet. Uh, I'm getting that you stand on your feet a lot. You need to soak your feet. Healing Truth Deck. This is for the Capricorns. Spirit, this is for the Capricorns. This is for the Capricorns. This is for the Capricorns. I'm getting the energy. Someone around you is scratching their head. Two Healing Truth cards came out. And we have one. And I feel like this is a, a message from the ancestors telling you this. Um, the ancestors crown you. Indicating you've been rewarded for... Focusing on your craft, yourself. I am so grateful. And then another Healing Truth card came out. Stop calling my phone. Not changing my mind. So I think that the ancestors are someone or maybe someone around you older. Or maybe um, a mentor is telling you about a specific person who is um, dogging you out. And um, is unappreciative to not pick up your phone, to not answer for them in no way, shape, or form. I appreciate the journey. Yeah. Leave me alone. Mm -hmm. Like they're telling you this. This is coming in real strong. Like, don't pick up that phone for them. Don't answer for them. They don't appreciate you. Yeah. I'm getting that really, really strong. What's this um, card? Going too fast, indicating being hasty, quick, in a hurry, stop and listen and, and feel. Uh, I'm also getting like you. Some of you are not even getting these messages. Like you, like you could possibly keep picking up for this person, per se. And a change is about to happen with that, and eventually. Um, you and this person are going to come to a halt because you're not even hearing the messages. Some of you are willingly hearing the messages and some of you are just not hearing the messages at all. Um, Spirit, could you... Um, oh, no, not... Um, just, a, just a moment. Um, I'm in the middle of something. Um, Uh-oh. I also was getting like spirit. Yeah, spirit is really just throwing a lot of messages at you. And some of you are getting them and some of you are not getting the messages at all. And this is leaving you really frustrated. <laughs> Look, messages came out and it came out in reverse. Some of you are not getting the messages at all. Yes, um, this is my ancestor card and... It came out in reverse too. Some of you are not listening to the messages in which your ancestors are given to you. About this person. It's a person in your life that is really trying to reap havoc. And, and you are really anxious about this. You are really like in the space of um, wanting to move fast. Like you're moving too fast. Like um, stop and take a breather. Yeah, um, the marriage card came out in reverse. This could be possibly somebody you thought that you were going to marry. Um, this person isn't good for you at all. Stop picking up the phone for them. Stop answering for them. Stop um, accepting test messages. Ignore them altogether. What? They're not worth your time. Period. Uh, may I have another card, Spirit? Oh, Yes, yeah, so many messages. So many messages are being thrown at you. 
you're just all in your head about it. Yeah, um, the child card came out. What's that? Yeah, somebody could be possibly praying. I'm getting that, like, um, praying, like, asking for something. Yeah, trying to manifest. This could be you, like, because I'm feeling like you're so anxious. Or it could be the person um, so anxious. Oh, I got to get in contact with this person. I got to get in contact with them. It could be, yeah. Yeah, but somebody is avoiding their healing. And this should be a healing time for them. I'm also getting that. I'm going to use the African deck. This is for the Capricorns. Yeah, they can see your gifts. Yeah, it's judgment for this. We have the Empress here and we have the Judgment card here. It's judgment for this um, situation. One second, please. <laughs> it's judgment for this situation. Like They see your gifts. They see that you're growing. They see all of these things. And they trying to get chose. <laughs> what was the overall? Yeah, they want uh, the Ten of Cups with you. They want like happiness and f fulfillment. But they have done nothing to fill your cup. They have been very mean. They have been... Um, they haven't given you any emotion or anything. But they want... They want their cup filled. Give me something to drink. I'm thirsty. That's what I'm hearing. Give me something. Oh, wow. Like I said, a lot of messages being. And you just want peace. Or they probably just want peace. Because you're not answering. Yes. Um, the two of swords. Like duplicity. Somebody is just. Back and forth. Double dipping. Why is this here? Yeah. And you're trying to just seize your moment. Yeah, and they're just trying to be a seducer. Hi. Hi, darling. Give me one second. And they're just trying to seduce. Seem like they just trying to seduce everybody. Hey, marry me, marry me, marry me. And I think you see this. You see like how they act. They're inconsistent. Their actions shows that they're not ready to really step forward with anything. That's what I'm getting with that. Any more? Yeah, and you're going to get justice for this by ignoring their ass. <laughs> yeah, because the Ten of Pentacles is here. They... I want fulfillment, you know. I want money. Oh, but spirit is right there watching your back. That's what that's what I'm getting from that. I'm just going to get one more. I'm just going to get one more. Card. One more card. Okay, darling. And I'm getting a sense like you're just laughing about this. Like, they're probably texting you saying all type of like, I'm ready now. I'm ready to be the emperor. I'm ready now. And you just like, I'm not looking at you. <laughs> I'm done with that. I'm not looking back at that. It's been too long. You've been dealing with this person for a long time. No, not right now. You've been dealing with this person for a long time. Yeah. Mm -mm. Yeah, and you're just trying to, like I said, seize your moment. I'm really getting that. No, no, no. You're just trying to really, like, seize your moment and um, 
be the best you i just feel like you're really stepping into you you could be a dancer i'm getting that like a um like a free spirit like to walk barefoot yeah of course you're a capricorn you like the ground or you should be like and they see this yeah you get i just feel like you're really getting justice from this emperor yeah because um they're not for your greater good yeah heartbreak you experienced a lot of heartbreak and you're done with that it's like uh -uh, i'm done with that i'm not fooling with this anymore um they're actually trying to send you into more heartbreak yeah <laughs> i also get in they thought that they thought that you were going to be there for a long time sitting there <laughs> loving guidance mm -hmm. they thought that you were going to just be there for a long time possibly tried to get you pregnant um or you're pregnant right now and they're just um their intentions were to just get you pregnant and and just basically just looking at you as an investment how would this how like how is this gonna go this is gonna like i'm getting that strongly like how is this gonna go like they seen something in you a long time ago like yeah i gotta hurry up and get her pregnant so i can lock her down or or I need to hurry up and let him get me pregnant so I can lock him down. 